guys. Okay, so he's waiting for us there. Quick, stop by the shop. Hopefully something- give me something good. What am I supposed to do here? I'm not sure what's going on, but I strongly suggest you give your best shot at this race against your evil twin. You have any stories? Those are stories. I do, but you should really get back to chasing the dark messenger. I'll tell you a good one after you save the day. Oh, better tell me a good one after I save the day. What is this? But the altar I saw at the top of our mountain. Why it is? I thought it would be a cool addition to my shop. <laughs> what happened to the cage monster thing? It was useless, so I got rid of it. For now, I'm using the altar to store any food, voodoo feathers and mask pieces you find. The magic within the altar tells me you've yet to find one more feather and four mask pieces. Well, that's handy. We'll come back for that later. Okay, a race, a race. Sure, we could do a race. He thinks. No, I can't do a race. I can't do a race. So what am I thinking? Who am I? Who got that? Wait, who got that? Oh no, that's just a start. Okay. 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 I can't race. I can't race. Why is my dark half better than I? Why is my dark half better than I? Okay. Grab on, grab on. Sticky Keys is about to turn on at any point in time now. Oh. Sticky. Uh, I should really change that button from, you know, not shift. Wait, can I shirk in that? I'm down a lot. Uh, if I could shirk in that. That might just be my ticket. Nope. Nope, this is just sheer incompetence. Nope. Oh, this is just all bad. Eh. <laughs> why is this just bad? Why is this bad? Why does why does everything hurt? An easy one this time. Thank you. We could come back, right? Everyone loves a good comeback story. Wait, you just you get a platform? Oi. Okay, well, we're ahead. Oh, not really. There we go. Got him. Two points for the good guys. Are we the good guys? Hard to tell. Does he change? Oh, he does change. That's interesting. Uh, what's not interesting is... Oh, and we can't see it. That's cool. Until he wins. Oh, he is definitely gonna win. Okay, goodbye me. Oh, goodbye me. Okay. Oh, I just die. Oh. Thanks, Quillvolt. Okay. Race better. I said better. Okay, this one doesn't count. Round one. Now that I know what we're doing. I really should change my... my grapple button to not shift. That would be great. Not great. Doesn't happen. <laughs> Three, four, don't press. Oh. I need to change it to not shift. There we go. That was the last last time. Wait, this is new. Wait a minute, this is illegal. Wait a minute. Why is this harder? Okay, uh, how are we compared to them? Pretty good. Oh, shirking doesn't work. That was a good neck and neck. This, however, is less good. Seriously, head starts? Nope. Okay. I, I do like the randomized aspect. Nah. 
This is gonna be a while. Gonna be a long, long time. Rocket man. Nope. Pendulum. Nope. Round three. Rematch. Oh. Hey, look, I'm winning this. I'm doing it. There we go. Why is that one so easy? Okay. Oh. Hit the wrong button. I'm, I'm not going to get used to this. Why am I worse than my, my dark half? No, this is just gonna be trial and error then. Okay, we'll just wait and see. Luckily these things are starting to cycle through. Nice. Oh wait, we're tied. Oh, we're tied. Oh wait, this is... bad. Wait, you get an elevator? Oi. Eh, this, this is that evil person privileges thing, isn't it? Taha. Ah, uh, wait, you knew which way to go. Oi. Okay. Oh, what's my health? One? Eh, uh, he's. He, well, either he's. Yeah, he made it. Okay. Oh, this is a good match. This is a good match. Until you failed that. Oh, come on. Oh, well. It was a good run while it lasted. That was actually a good run. Round three. Hello? Hello? Goodbye. Goodbye me. Goodbye. Goodbye. What is his name? Corval Quicksort. Conundrum. Quanto. His name was Quantum. Okay, well, wait, where is the top of this? Hey, found it. Take the... Round six. This one's for the good guys. I can't wait till they explain how we managed to finagle our way through this one. No, I never go through there. Okay, sure, we'll take that. Uh, yeah, they want you to take the upper way. Look how easy upper way is. Upper way is... Yeah, they just want you to take upper way. Done. Oh, wait, this is new. This is new. This is new. Okay, okay. Uh, early lead. Nice. That's an easy one. I'm just gonna clear this. Okay. Oh, he's on the other side. Uh, I have what? One heart? Uh, zero now. That's a long one. That's an enemy gauntlet. Okay, that's. Sure, we'll take that. Oh, he's on the inverse side. Taking the lead. Will I make that? Sure, I will. Just will it, and it happens. Like my death. Yeah, these are new ones. I wonder how they're being generated. Okay. Bird, please. 
Let's take a little shortcut. Oh, he took the shortcut too. We're tied. This is an easy one. This is an easy one if you're good enough. This is an easy one if you aren't- oh well I think I lost. Oh I definitely lost. Uh -huh. Yeah these things are going up. Yeah. Round five. And this is why you don't do things so early in the morning. This is why you don't, you know, face your dark side in the hours of, in the waking hours. I wish I could hit that with shuriken. Last one. Okay, it's this one again. Boy. Ah, there we go, finally. Ah, oh. We've won this day. That's it, I can retire now, in peace. No peace says nothing as usual. And now who are we facing, both of them? Oh. And so the messenger wins the race. It's over, demon. Your plans failed. Release the hostages now. Now, now, let's not be hasty. You merely played into my hand once again, ninja. Uh? Oh, let that go again. Go home, improvement. For the dark messenger's full potential to be unleashed, it first needs to be untethered from its greed, demon. Oh, how how I've been waiting for this moment. Now, my dark messenger, I reckon it's time for us to... Merge? Merge? <gasps> do the thing! He's gonna do the thing! Thing! He did the thing! The thing is done! Oh, the thing! The long-anticipated thing! Oh, that's... Oh! Odd proportions. Ah, uh, I knew it. The uh old -oh, is actually pretty bad. I'll be right back. But we're supposed to do the thing, buddy. I, I get all that, but even if the scroll had somehow been copied too, it doesn't mean they should be able to. Well, well, if it isn't the shopkeeper, he's he's just the shopkeeper. Okay, that's not gonna do it all. What, surely if we do the thing we could defeat it? Oh, without a doubt, it's just the hat on this guy. Well, why don't we do the thing then? Listen, I'm all for fighting bu bucky bosses, but fashion statements are something I take very seriously. One moment, please. Alright, it's showtime. With our powers combined. The thing will be done, and we get massive kaiju fight. We get punch out! I'll play punch out. Wait, how do I dodge? What's my dodge button? Okay, there is a dodge button. Okay, I played punch out. Two, three, four, five. Our punch. Okay, no. Come on. Okay, I got no timer. This is good. Oh. Man, of all the games I'd be playing, Punch Out wasn't one of them. I wasn't one I expected. Love it. Three, four. Okay. Oh, I'm low. Can I start punch? Can I do anything special? Two, three, four. Looks like I'm almost ready for a special. Round one to us. Oh. 
Oh, lovely work. Lovely pixel work. Fight. Round two. Two, three, four, five. I feel like he needs more um. This is a good fight though. He did the thing. Two, three. Almost special ready. Man, I just wanna play punch out. I just wanna play punch out. Hey, two bruises. Here we go, he's angry now. Fight. We got this. We're actually quite low. Oh, that's one down. Okay, good. He gets one round, but we've already got two over him. Really simple. But man, is it fun. And good fan service. Okay, there we go. Picking up speed once again. Luckily, nothing cheap. No, no, you know, game breaking knockout. Okay, that. Okay, some new moves. A lot of new moves. Oh, and he refilled health. Fight. Good, this is close. Just how I wanted it to be. I probably should have hit him more before activating that. Oh no, that finished him though. Kudyokin. Oh. Now that's a finale. Might have peaked Mike a couple times. Oh, that was amazing. It work. Plan three. The voodoo energy is finally loose and ready to be absorbed. What is he on about? Didn't we just knock this guy out? Behold, as a magic seed ripens before your very eyes. Whoa, I don't want a seed like that. I could deal with whatever you had to throw at me, demon. Oh, you won this round, Messenger. No, I won three rounds. But I will return. Huh? Call it to be continued. Well, that takes care of that. Oh, I can't wait to see what he does with the seed. Can't be any better than doing the thing. What should we do in the meantime? Him. <clears throat> Could you maybe get us out of here? It's about time we had that picnic. We're starving. And then we left them in the volcano. Yes, let's go to the picnic. Yay. Opo oh, beckons. Thank you for joining us at the picnic. Well, thanks for the input. This is amazing. Hey, we get post credits. How are you doing? How are you doing, Ruxton? Definitely didn't read that off the palm of my hand. What'd you send again? Oh, this party isn't so bad, but I need to get back to my lab soon. Let me know when you're ready. No. Nose at the top. Phew, what an adventure. Yeah, we only organize this picnic because we want permission to drink little juice boxes. It'll be worth it in the end. Oh, juice boxes. Sure, you had to leave soon. Food Can Island is so much fun. If you ever need to measure anything, you could use me and the bottom of my shoes to 
tip of this tape, I measure exactly 112 centimeters. Wait a minute. There's a puzzle there somewhere. That fight was sick. We should do the thing again sometime. We should. Well, he said you'd tell me a story after everything was resolved. Oh, yeah, I suppose I did. You want to hear a story then? Alright, here's one for you. It's a story about a story. Or more precisely, about a friend of mine's relation to it. Here we go. There once was a little girl who had a favorite fairy tale. She couldn't get enough of it. Every week she wanted to hear it again. And much like the dysfunctional patterns we recreate in our lives, I bet part of her was hoping that by listening this, to the same very story endlessly, its ending would eventually change. Because you see, she only truly liked the first half of the fairy tale. It went something like this. How deep are we going? Once upon a time, there lived a monstrous beast in the castle who kept a form former farmer. Text that that could look like an A. I think that's an A. Kept a farmer, former farmer. Where's an O? Where's an O? Oh, that's an O. Kept the farmer prisoner in his dungeon. One day, the farmer's daughter went to the beast's castle to offer herself as a prisoner in exchange for her father's freedom. The farmer belonged. No, the farmer being quite a selfless dad, and the beast quite a reasonable bully, everyone instantly agreed. At first, very scared and put off by the beast's appearance, she quickly learned to look past the surface and became quite fond of him. Far from being a blatantly romanticized case of Stockholm Syndrome to that found in her feelings towards him grew into genuine love. But the beast, as it soon turned out, was actually a beautiful prince who had the misfortune of being turned into a monster by an evil witch. A spell which could only be broken by receiving a kiss from his true love. The power of this relationship helped them reconnect with the good within him and his past as a cat there never revisited or brought into question after he became the farmer's son-in-law. They all lived happily ever after. Yeah. yeah, everyone knows that one. Of course, but I remember it's about my friend. And, well, specifically his daughter. Wait, what? She didn't like the story so much past a certain point. Why do you think that is? Maybe she thinks bees are cooler than humans. That's a fair guess. All she told me is that she didn't like the prince's voice anymore once he was returned to his human's form. But she's a clever one, and I can't shake the feeling that part of her thought it really... That thought it didn't make sense that someone who had the depth and maturity to look past the surface would receive a reward as super superfluous as good looks. Superfluous? That's a new word for me. Or maybe that's where the whole deal became awfully suspicious. If you think about it, there's always something sketchy about apparent perfection. Maybe the appearance of a beast showcasing hideousness so openly at least offers the security of letting you know what you're in for. A trait so evident and repulsive it could only be uphill from there for the one who would take a closer look. Whereas with a perfect front all there is left is to slowly deconstruct this perfection by slowly noticing flaws. It is a rare and valuable thing for people to look past the surface and so why would it make sense for them to Eh, to offer them something shallow and material in response. I find it... I find it to also convey a very important message. A message you need to play, pay close attention to notice, but which is nonetheless written anywhere between the lines. Contrast carries beauty. Ooh, that's a good one. A colorful shirt of the introvert. A pack of watermelon bubblegum in the old lady's purse. The melodic background harmonies of the death metal song. Ooh, I do love those. The cute earrings of, a st of the stone face. The smell of dust kicking up one rain combines with the bright sun on a hot summer day. While others may benefit from paying attention to more stories, some people perceive these things instinctively. Seeing how curious and captivated you are, I'd wager you belong in the second group. And when it comes to my friends, sometimes I felt Sometimes I like to think that, to her, a better title for this fairy tale would have been The Beauty in the Beast. 
I'm not sure what to make of all this. Oh, don't overthink it. It's just my special way of saying... Whoa. Oh, I don't think that's true. Jikuji. That's my best bet. That's my best guess. To that little girl. Hopefully she enjoyed this more if I had sung happy birthday to her. And as to you, Messenger, I hope that in the end you won't think your adventure would have been better without a bonus tropical side quest. Anyway, vacation's over. I should go and pack now. See you on the A-side. There's a little wink there. I felt... There was a wink there. I felt a wink there. Just me? Uh... Wait. Do I have access to the map? No. Can I swim down here? No. Can I just leave? Goodbye. Oh. Yes, we'll leave Utkin Island. We'll come back though. We've got collectibles to get. Very, very hard collectibles to get. Oh, we get moving, moving credits. Ooh, what to say about DLC? I mean... It is more messenger. It's harder messen- it, Well, it feels like harder messenger? Yeah. I mean, I've already shared my statements on how, you know, Messenger was already great. How much I loved, loved just the sense of humor it had, how much I loved this kind of swords my actual time crystals. Perfect. Oh, thank you for playing. That's all I could say. DLC is great. You know, come back, we get more characters, things like that. More dialogue. Just more things. Meanwhile, I taught the Searin Crags. Searin Crags? Oh, you too! Yo, it's kinda crazy, Coloss. This new diet may be so flexible. So I see, Susses. To think we're relying on brute strength alone this whole time. We should train more assiduously, Susses. New word, plus two. I agree completely, Coloss. Good day to you, Cyclopses. Were you waiting for someone, Susses? I have no idea who's under that cloak, Kalos. Nature business wanderer. Pardon the intrusion. I was looking for experienced botanists, and rumor has it you two are the best the silent has to offer. Yo, this guy's correct, Kalos. Let's see what he wants us is. What's it to you, wanderer? You see, I've come across a very rare magic seed, which, given proper care, is bound to grow into a beautiful plant. Paul? What do you reckon, Kalos? You gotta see that seed, Sussis. You have our attention, Wander. Show us. With pleasure. Here. And did I forget to mention? It will give herbs that could be used for cooking. There's definitely an eyebrow raise there. We are still planting the seed, Sussis. Cowabunga. Ooh. Cowabunga, Kalos. What could go wrong? Say no more wonder, we'll grow the magic seed. Oh, that was fun. Yeah, I must admit, I'll miss the beach. So, yes. Will the adventure continue sometime later? That's not up to me. Feel free to replay Picnic Panic as many times as you want, though. No, oh, it's the altar. <laughs> the altar's here. Still haven't found the money wrench. But, yeah, we'll get to that there. Yeah, we'll get there. <laughs>